Okay, today we had some good weather. I know everyone is hype on fall, but we still got a few days this summer and I want it. Yeah, I want it too. <laughs> and uh, Curtis, things are going to cool down a little bit later on this week, though. Yeah, not unusually so, Steve, but they are going to cool down in behind a cold front that'll probably move through uh, around tomorrow at this time. It's a beauty out there. Downtown Sky Cam, a little bit of haze from the wildfires, but not as thick as it was yesterday. I do think some of that smoke will kind of increase again tomorrow. 81 degrees, south winds 14, that humidity 47%. So we had a little break with the southwest wind, but in behind that front, some more smoke's going to kind of hang around the next couple of days. It has not had a huge impact on air quality here in Iowa so far. 80s give way to 70s, eventually giving way to 60s, but it will not be as cool as the past couple of nights because of that wind direction. It'll keep the temperatures up a bit. Here we go, Hurricane Sally. It is moving so slowly right now. It's about 44 miles off the coastal islands there. It is a category one storm, sustained winds at 80 miles an hour. Again, that movement just two miles an hour. It looks like it will push up Mobile Bay, cause some problems there, and then slowly move up the coast. The big threat with this is obviously the winds because they're going on for a long period of time because of the movement, the storm surge, but also the potential for some tremendous rains. I think parts of Alabama, Florida will probably see 10 to 20 inches of rain, maybe a few spots squeezing out two feet of rain down there, and then it'll move up the coast with still heavy rain, but not as heavy as that original impact when it moves on shore. Clouds from this will get up to about southeastern Missouri. This is our front moving through tomorrow afternoon. Just quiet weather overall across the Midwest. Thursday, I think we'll see a few clouds filter in. Friday will be the coolest day of the next eight. There'll be some clouds around and there's just a slight chance of maybe a sprinkle at best. You can see the cooler temperatures in behind the front tomorrow. Out in front of it, 80s St. Louis, 80s Indianapolis, and near 80 over in Detroit. Forecast tonight, clear skies, mild temperatures, just a beautiful night. 60 degrees. Enjoy these days. Well, they don't last forever. Uh, tomorrow, 84 degrees, mostly sunny, a bit breezy. The winds are actually going to move around, but the general direction it out of the west. You can see it southwest to west to west northwest as that front moves on through 60s to 70s and then 80s in the afternoon. Town to town shapes up like this. Sunshine ahead over in a Dell looks around 81 in Ames. Greenfield 82, mostly sunny skies in Atlantic. Enjoy a beautiful day. Again, cooler to the north because that front moves on through. You'll feel a bit of a difference over in Clarion 79, Webster City 80 degrees. But 86 in Bloomfield, a very warm day in Centerville, mostly sunny and mid 80s. Eight day forecast, cooler 70s Thursday, Friday, just a slight chance of a shower. Weekend right now looks pretty good. 70s both Saturday and Sunday, and you can see the general trend. It's not going anywhere. We bounce back to the 80s to finish your eight day.